Good morning, everyone. It is Monday, which is the first day of classes. I have to say, I'm quite excited to start classes. I actually have to change my schedule a bit just because I'm also taking classes online at my home university and I'm enrolled like in full-time schedule here plus two others over there. So I... I hope the angle's fine. So my first class is at 11. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it, but I'm gonna go to it today. And I'm just getting ready. I'm just excited to have a routine, some consistency, some kind of structure. I struggle to talk and do my makeup at the same time. Honestly, I feel like I've already been here for a few weeks, but it hasn't even been a week. So I feel like maybe just the structure of things will help that. The classes I'm taking, I guess I'll talk more about them later, but they're kind of learning more about like fun stuff based in Florence. Like today I have a history of food class. The class I think that I am going to keep is social media, social food, and then intercultural communications. Basically, I only need three classes in order to graduate. So I need international and economics course, like my final year course, then like an anthropology course, and the intercultural communications course will count as my anthropology course, but the others just for fun. Friday, I think that we have an event in the countryside, which I'm excited for, I'm looking forward to that. I haven't heard much about it yet. They said we get an email and we don't really have to sign up for it to show up, so. We're visiting a vineyard. Oh, yesterday. I was so, so motivated yesterday. You know, try and make my space really nice. Like I got those lights from Flying Tiger. They didn't work after returning them. And I got hummus and that was the worst tasting hummus ever. There was something wrong with it. it there was something wrong with that. I don't have good Wi-Fi here. It doesn't reach to my room. So I wanted to look for coffee shops that I could work from and I said that this one would you can work from. So I went, their coffee machine was broken. I'm like, okay, whatever, got an ice drink and a matcha, ice and matcha. And then and the Wi-Fi wasn't working. And then I was like, I can still edit this without Wi-Fi. I'm a little iffy, but I still can. Finally, a waitress came over and said, we don't let what computers on the weekends. And they didn't say just to me, but they said to other people around, but like one thing after another. Quite annoying. I don't know, let's hope this today goes good. Like I'm not planning to go anywhere else besides classes. I just wanna come home afterwards and edit my video. Since I can do it without Wi-Fi, I guess. I can't do schoolwork without Wi-Fi. Actually, you know what? The vlog is kind of long. So I feel like this segment might be the beginning of another video. So if you don't know what I was referencing about the coffee shop and the light, check out the video before this. I got this hairspray. La di capelli. And I really like it. At breakfast, it's been my fun little um, moment of stability. I've been thinking of where I want to travel while I'm here. I watched Meg Hughes's video in London. It made me really, really miss it. Like, I know I missed it, but watching that video. The thing I don't miss, though, is the wind there and the cold. It's pretty nice not having to deal with that here. So far, I don't know. We'll see about today and this week. Anyway, I'm gonna go. I'll see you um, probably at breakfast knowing me. <laughs> Um, and then it classes. Ciao.
day. And back in the kitchen and making breakfast, of course. Classes have been okay. I really enjoyed the first one. Yesterday I had social media, social food. Basically I just went to class and then had another class that I'm taking online through my home university. I did also, I also did food shopping, which I showed. I wanted half and half for my coffee and I really didn't know what half and half was. I looked it up, couldn't find what it said. So I got this milk, I don't know. We're gonna try it. I mean, either way, I feel like it would be good. Gotta cut these. I'm actually surprised that they still have these in Europe. I thought that was like an American thing. Ooh, it's ready. Beautiful. Okay. Let's taste it. Mm. 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 Yeah, I think it's like milk. I think it's just milk. We're gonna try to froth it. I got my oatmeal cooking. How much else? Friday. We have like an event to a vineyard, which I'm looking forward to. That should be fun. Every night, our power goes out and I have to go down to the circuit breaker to turn it on in the morning. So that's fun. But the thing is, we don't have anything on. So, I gotta say, Subby Broad's great, but it's not all sunshine and rainbows. I also got Greek yogurt, which is good because I wanted thick yogurt. I'm gonna assemble my oatmeal bowl. It's like a cream or whatever. Mm. Okay, and now the Mars Capone one, which is the Florentina. Fiorentina. Oh, that's good. And, and the hazelnut. No, no, chestnut. After my meltdown. <laughs> <laughs> What's your rating? Um, um, like eight out of ten, but only because this is like really chocolatey, and I don't really do. Well oh, with the like soccer really tour. Yeah. yeah. That's why I was wondering really when I saw it. The tiramisu is insane. Though. It is, it is. I would just come back for the tiramisu, I think. Mm -hmm. It's delicious. It's delicious. <laughs>